Hi everyone, I'm Marielle and welcome to Perspective. You cannot live a positive life kapag negatron ka when you stay negative all day. That is why the purpose of my video is to fill your mind with positive thoughts para magkaroon tayo ng right perspective towards life. And I want to begin by asking, how to beat bitterness? Meron dalawang farmer, positive farmer at negative farmer. Kapag tag-araw, ang sinasabi ni positive farmer, salamat sa sunlight, takakatulong to sa tanim namin. Si negative farmer naman ang sinasabi, nako, pag nagtagal yung araw, matutuyot yung halaman, mamamatay. Kapag tagulan naman, ang sinasabi ni positive farmer, thanks for the rain, nakakatulong to sa tanim namin. Si negative farmer ang sinasabi, Naku, pag nagtagal yung ulan na yan, mabababad yung halaman namin, mamamatay. So isang araw, naghunting silang dalawa. May kasamang aso si positive farmer. Namaril ng ibon si positive farmer, bumagsak yung ibon sa gitna ng lake. Ang ginawa ng aso, tumakbo sa ibabaw ng tubig. Kinuha yung ibon, ibinigay kay positive farmer. Yung nakita yun ni negative farmer, takang-taka siya. Hindi siya makapaniwala. Sabi niya, Ano? Hindi marunong lumangoy yung aso mo? <laughs> Pambihira, di ba? Have you met people like that? Negatron? Yung wala ka nang marinig sa salita niya, kundi puro negative? Alam mo kung katulad ka ni negative farmer? Most likely, you live life holding on things that weighs you. Masyado ka nakahawak dun sa mga bagay na nagpapabigat sa'yo. Worry, bitterness, guilt, jealousy. Sa bagay, lahat naman tayo may negative feelings. Lahat naman tayo may negative emotions. They come naturally. And there's nothing wrong about that. Nagiging problema lang yan if you let them in. Why? Because they occupy space. Na dapat sana magagandang bagay ang laman. Think about this. God created you like a container. You are supposed to be filled with love, joy, peace, confidence. Pero anong ginagawa mo? Hinahayaan mo itong mga negative feelings na to to fill you, to fill the container. 20% sa worry kasi stress ka sa trabaho mo. 20% sa bitterness kasi galit ka sa kapitbahay mo na chismosa. 20% guilt, beating yourself kasi kinukonsensya mo sarili mo from past mistakes. Tapos madadagdagan pa yan ng 10% insecurity, hindi mo makuha yung promotion na gusto mo. 10% jealousy, kasi mas maganda yung kotse ng kapatid mo. So hindi mo namamalayan, 80% na palang ina-occupy nun sa buhay mo. And there's no room left for all the good things na gustong ibigay sa'yo ng Panginoon. Kaya hindi mo ma-appreciate ang buhay. Sa tingin mo ba nagwa-worry ang doktor kapag merong impurity sa katawan mo? Hindi. Nagwa-worry siya kung hindi niya maaalis yung impurities. Kasi alam niya, you will be infected. So stop living life looking at the rearview mirror. Wala ka nang magagawa sa mga bagay na nangyari na. Control what you think about. Control kung ano yung papasok dito. Release the impurities. Empty out the negatives. And that is how to beat bitterness. And I pray, may the Lord gives you clear mind and an open heart to receive the message of this video. Amen.
Thanks for watching and I hope that you are blessed by this episode. Please subscribe and hit the bell to get notified sa mga latest uploads ko. Remember, be a blessing to people around you. Share this video. See you next time!